Avelino from Morris Sully, Michigan, has a question about attic ventilation. Well, yeah, he's a house flipper. He's run into a little bit of a pickle, Tom. Mm. He says, uh, I, my, I flipped this, this older house here. <clears throat> I flipped this older house here and with no attic, barely any dead space between the roof and the ceilings. And the inspectors said the house needs soffit vents and more roof vents. The roof already has ridge vents on the peaks. Does the roof really need more venting if there's no attic? That's a, you know, this is an incredibly good question, and it's a really short answer, which I know you'll like. Uh, <laughs> if you can vent it, you vent it well. You do soffit vents, you do ridge vents, you know, you do those things. But if you can't vent it, and I had a house in Galveston, Texas at one time, there was no way to vent it, then you close it up. It's either one or the other. And if, if you can't do it right, then don't do it at all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Think about that one. <laughs> anyway. Hey, and yet we're here. And it. yet don't we're here it. every day. <laughs> yes. right. Okay. So, so either vent it or don't. And in his case, it sounds like you're saying don't. Because there's no airspace. There's no attic space. There's nothing of that. So if you open it, water will get up in there and not leave. Don't. Don't do it. Don't do that. Okay. Yeah. Good. But you should do is go visit homeshowradio.com. Send us more of your questions. That's what we're here for every day. Go ahead, visit there. Click in the Ask Tom form. Fill it out. Send it in. And we'll send out a video that looks just like this answering your question. In fact, we've posted thousands of questions. You can find them all on our YouTube channel. And maybe you want to peruse those for an answer. 